gonna make a video about why I chose the oil. You don't know, I'm a very spontaneous person. I change my mind very easily. Yo, medical school is not easy. Average salary for public health is... Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome or welcome back. If you don't know me, my name is Anne and I'm a college student. If you don't know that, and I don't know if you've been watching my YouTube channel, but it's mostly been about college student. So if you see me looking down, I'm looking at my iPad because I'm looking at pointers for what I'm going to talk about. So my major is public health, health sciences concentration, and I'm on the pub, um, pre med track <clears throat> so i wanted to share with you why i chose public health as my pre-med major because it's not mostly talked about on youtube and i really wanted someone to talk about it when i was looking to um major in public health so i wanted to be that person that gives the little bit of information you can google it of course but i'm just gonna make a video about why I chose it. Originally, I was going in for biology as my major for pre-med, cause most of the time people go in for biology is the most common one. But um, one time before coming here during the summer, I had an advising meeting with one of the people here on campus and she advised me to go for public health as my pre-med major. So, the reason why she said it was biology really talks about many other things like plants animals and stuff and i love biology but i didn't want to learn about animals and plants and all that stuff again i just wanted to be human and diseases concentrated when i came to college so i was fascinated that she said i should choose public health so I did some research and then decided to go with it. So here are five reasons why I chose public health as my pre-med major. So as I already said, it focuses on human diseases, human-centered um, problems, and it's like the background of medicine. They help public health um, workers help um, prevent diseases from um, getting too high more, uh, more people like getting the diseases so i love that about public health how they are like the at the back but doing a lot of work that people don't even see i love that and then it also has some of the prerequisites embedded in the degree that you have to take which really excited me because i didn't want to take my prerequisites as an, um classes that made my workload too much so i decided to go with public health if you are um going to if you want to go to medical school like my my goal is after college you know that you have to fulfill these prerequisites in order to take the mcat which is the exam for the medical school and you also have to get the prerequisites for the medical schools that you apply to each school has a different one but most of it is biology, orga organic chemistry, chemistry, um, calculus, I think, yeah. So, and there are other things as well. But I love how um, public health has some of the prerequisites embedded in the degrees. Um, it's already in your degree, so you don't have to take it again. And number three, Biology, as I said, is the most chosen pre-med uh, major. In, unless some of the schools have pre-med majors as like a major that you can take. But most of the colleges now, when I was applying to colleges, I realized none of them really have public um, pre-med as a major. They just have other majors and then you, you register yourself as on the pre-med track and then they will add the <clears throat> prerequisites to your classes when it comes when you come to um, college 
so public health was kind of a tangent um i researched i think yesterday and i saw that many people are going for public health now because medical schools are seeing that most people go for biology and they want diversity they want variety in the majors that people take and when you go when you search when i was choosing my um, pre-med major i was a little confused i knew i wanted to get into biology because that was the most um common one but when i researched most of the people were like go for your interest go for what you like so i thought mm, i don't really have anything that i really like i just know i want to be in the health sector like the health field that's what i've been wanted to wanting to um at a very young age so i didn't know any um anything that interested me so public health was the tangent that i got because public health still deals with health issues and pandemics and stuff so it's not away from the medical field but it's just like they take care of the things behind the scenes in, in terms of preventing diseases and pre preventing the spread of diseases and another reason why i chose it was in uml i don't know about other schools but anatomy and physiology is a part of your degree that you have to take and anatomy and physiology is a critical course that you need to take if you want to go to medical school because medical school you're just going to from my watching of other medical stu school students on um, YouTube, my favorite is Rachel Southhead and um, Common Medicine. They look at cadavers, they do stuff, and they digest, they dissect and stuff. So you need to know each part of the body and the anatomical positions and stuff to do all that so taking anatomy is good so no matter what um, major that you go to you have to add anatomy as a undergraduate course so that you can have a little refresh because <clears throat> i heard anatomy and in medical school is really hard because you have to go into details of everything of everybody and all the parts Actually, I had four four points reasons why I chose it. Oh, I remember the fifth one. The fifth one is when I researched it, you could get into many many jobs if you decide not to go into medical school after getting your public health um, degree, which was something I really wanted because you don't know i'm a very spontaneous person i change my mind very easily so i just wanted something that after school i could just get a job if i wanted to and i didn't want to stress myself with medical school because you know medical school is not easy it's a very long journey and if you're not committed to it it's just gonna be tedious and not profitable but i like it but just in case I don't want to go into um, medical school anymore. Oh, you can also go into PA school with public health major because it also talks about diseases and um, issues about the environment and stuff and how it relates to diseases and human health and stuff like that. So I really love public health. Now that I'm learning about it, I've learned how they really focus on preventing diseases not just curing it but preventing it and also stopping the uh, the spread when it comes out like during the um, COVID-19 they help with making uh, vaccinations they put measures in place like wear your mask everywhere you go and all that stuff so I really love that and so to top it off some of the areas you can go into with public health <clears throat> is healthcare administrator public health advisor public health administrator public health analyst health educator common uh, community health 
coordinator and community health water and the average salary for public health is like 37 thousand per year it's not that much but as you grow and as you experience more as you work hard you get promoted and your salary increases so these are the five reasons why i am currently studying public health and hoping to go into medical school with this major um this undergraduate degree when i'm done so hope you learned a thing or two and you get a good decision on which one that you like for medical school as i already said you can go into english major you can go into math major you can go into arts major and then get your prerequisites for medical school and still get in and i think medical schools even with um, prefer when you don't do a health focused major and still get your prerequisites it shows how you, you're not just um focused on health and stuff like that but if you want to go into public health as your major these are the reasons why you may want to consider it for that thank you for everyone who watched me and i hope you had a good week because i'll post this on friday today is monday so if you haven't subscribed yet why i just want to know <laughs> like share and comment if you have any questions about public health or pre-med or medical school i'll you can put them in the comment section i'll answer to the best of my ability and thank you so much for watching